Welcome to my lair. Skip to my loo, my darling. Hi guys, it's Lou and it's Try It Tuesday. So what I am going to try is to make my own Biore strip. Now I have an old trick that's you know, everybody's kind of used, but I also have a recipe that I found online that I'd like to try as well. But we're gonna start with, guess what? Glue. Elmer's good old fashioned school glue. I do have a couple of, of tips to start out with before you actually put on even a Bure strip. First though, you do want to remove any makeup, duh that you've got on your nose. So I'm doing that now. And second, you want to use just plain old rubbing alcohol because that allows either the strip or the glue or whatever you're using to stick and it gives a dry surface of not only your blackheads but your actual skin as well so a little alcohol and my third tip for using a pore strip of any kind would be to actually get a washcloth and run it under some hot water and hold it on your nose for I don't know 30 seconds or so because what that'll do is it will open the pores on your nose and let the juice of the strip go where it needs to go to pull those bad boys out. My nose is drying still. I think I want to put more than one layer. Layer. So I'm going to put on some of this handy dandy Elmer's school glue, which is in ready supply when you have a 10 year old in your house. I'll tell you that much. So here, look, putting glue on my face. I'm just gonna do a couple of layers because I kind of really want this to work. And I don't think that one layer is going to be enough to pull off in one piece. I think it needs to be thicker. Do you remember in grade school when you'd put this stuff on your hands only to blow it dry and then peel it off and show someone like you've peeled your skin off? I never did that. Maybe I did. Okay, so this is a thick layer. So it better work, but like I said, I have a recipe too. That we're gonna try that out. So it's either test it Tuesday or try it Tuesday, or Tango Tuesday, or Terrible Tuesday. Let's just stick with try it. All right, big layer. My layer. Welcome to my layer. Okay. I'm gonna come back when it's dry and then we're gonna peel it off and see what grossness gets on there. All right, so I've put two thick layers of Elmer's glue on and as you can see, it's kind of lifted right here because who can go 15 minutes without eating something? I can't. So it's peeling up. I'm just gonna peel it up. I hope you can, oh God, that's freaking close. Ah. So here I go peeling from the outside in like you would. Ow. Do you hear it? Holy moly. Look. Ow. Ta-da. I have residual glue on my face. Okay, let's take a little peek not seeing anything exciting at all. And look, there's little holes in it. <laughs> anyway, nothing worth seeing anyway. It, uh, it didn't seem to pull anything off or do anything. I tried. I will tell you that my nose is dry as can be now. A little moisturizer is needed and what I'm going to do is go get the ingredients for the recipe that I have 
to make a pore strip and apparently it's supposed to work really well like a part two thank you for watching please subscribe skipped my lou i'm lou and we have a giveaway coming up but i haven't figured out what we're giving away yet but it's gonna be good have a good day bye faux bang tutorial and when i say bang